with regard to Well, because he's got some weird idea of friendship. He thinks that we're friends. We'd, I'd never have been to his house other than I paid $1,000 to go meet Hillary Clinton. Okay? That's the one time in all of these years that I've never had dinner with the man. Would you want to? No. <laughs> Why not? Why? Oh, please. I, well, first of all, we're not friends, and, you know, I have enough friends. Uh, I don't need to go out to dinner with John. I don't, you know, I've never uh, done any of the things that friends do. But he w was at a debate, and he said, well, maybe we're not friends, but I admire you. And I said, okay, now we're friends. All right? I mean, so I don't know what to say about that. Joe and I have been friends since he was uh, working for Rudy Giuliani. I like Joe. We get along fine. He's a lovely man. Uh, John, you know, you all have to make up your own decision about him. He's got a billion dollars, so you treat him like he's a serious candidate. All right? Is I understand that. Is he no, he's not a serious candidate, and you know he's not a serious candidate. You all know that he's not a serious candidate, but you know that he's got billions of dollars, so what does he do? He advertises on the TV, which I cannot, so therefore, right from the very beginning, I was going to lose the election, and the man with the most money is going to win. Well, I'm looking forward to the people, actually. You know these polls that, that you all do? You measure 100 people, 130 people in these polls. 130 Republicans, and then you decide who the front runner is and who has what. The, the, the margin of error in the last poll was 9.5%. Okay? I had 12%, Casmatidis had 22%. So couldn't it be flipped? Couldn't I be ahead of him? But nobody would ever report that.